But what connected them was uh, the gang, great directing, great writing, New York, um, and and the genre just that time. And then the Warriors was the Dockers, like the antithesis of of the Wanderers. That's why that's what made them both so powerful. Perhaps they feed off of each other. You know, the Wanderers had kind of a lighter feel to it, whereas the Warriors had more of that tough fight scene feel to it. I think Walter Hill and um, and um, Philip Kaufman had the same kind of vision initially, like it was going to be that surreal kind of fantasy thing. But the Warriors had the lead on the Wanderers, and I think Phil pulled back on some of his stuff. We shot at Union Station. Then we went into a story. Right now we're in a story of studios in this stuff. And um, I'm just near the, the bathrooms. I'm going to turn around and then skate backwards, bend down. I see Lino or Rembrandt put his feet down. I open the door. He sprays me with paint and then a big fight scene breaks out. That fight scene took like over a week to shoot, you know, and um, it was like a it was like a ballet. Um, Craig Baxley was the stunt coordinator on that. Oh my gosh, it was literally like a ballet, the way it was uh, put together. The Warriors came along and I was hired as a stuntman Walter asked me, can you skate? And I was like, sure. I didn't know how to skate at the time, you know. So I would go out and practice skating. Um, I would do these 25 mile run, rides or runs or rolls. And one time the police tried to pull me over, you know. And so, um, I was, uh, I said, I can't, you know. And he goes, uh, you know, pull over. And I said, no, I can't. And I'm skating for a record. And if he still pulled me over, I would have told him I'm skating to my friend's house to, um, to, um, pick up a Led Zeppelin album, you know, like that kind of record. There was a scene where they throw a Molotov cocktail on the car. And then the barriers run off and then it explodes. Well, I did the explosion stunt on that. Like, well, to put me in a cap, you know, so you wouldn't see me uh, close to my skating character. And so that was the fun of it. With the punks, originally, after the baseball series um, was shot, they really toned down the punks. Like originally, there was a, co a leopard co uh, jumpsuit made for me, and um, after that, Walter toned us down, just put us in like football jerseys and uh, overalls. As a matter of fact, with movie magic, I happen to have a picture. I was walking out of out of um, 240, 241st Street, White Plains Road, the subway. And these two guys were walking, all of a sudden they jumped back, like, you know, like I was going to kick their ass. And I'm like, oh, and I'm just an actor, you know. And I wound up talking with them, and that was fun. So there was that side. But then I'll talk with, say, somebody who is, um, loves the Wanderers, and it's just more of a friendly family conversation. It's just two distinct experiences from two movies shot during the same period. But just to be a part of both, it's, um, it's, it's an honor, you know. But you don't know that that's happening as you're doing it. It's just, uh, I'm working.